The brickwork on this building here is fantastic. Some interesting old buildings. Birmingham, like any other city, has its designated quarters. We're in the Chinese quarter. I'm <laughs> absolutely loving that. Wow, so very, through a very tight gate there. So you can see where they've uh, bricked it up. Somebody's uh, knocked our way in for us. So I'm wandering around the ground floor here. It's absolutely huge. Crunchy, crunchy sound. Can you only imagine the smells from the food that used to get cooked in here? There's a fridge. Original bit of air conditioning. It's been a long time since anything was plugged in there. I imagine the queue used to form around this way. Seems more logical. Original plates. It'd be good if they had the, uh, the logo to the company on them.
So it really is like a big labyrinth, this place. Shit, it sounds like somebody's in here. I wonder what these used to be. Somewhere where people used to keep their bikes, maybe? I'm loving like the railway kind of feel to the steelwork. That would have been a steam engine when this factory was built. There you see, we're quite high up here. You see that thing on the top there that looks like a mushroom? Let's go and look at that. I must say I love how this building is designed. Proper 1940s uh, ingenuity. Views from over Birmingham here are spectacular. Beautiful parquet floor. I oh know somebody's been sleeping here. Some kind of wheel here for a lift. Oh, what the that oh, jacket still hanging up. Green TV. So I say once you're here, you're fairly safe. There's only one way in and out. See something that doesn't look safe? Go this staircase here. You wouldn't want to fall down there.
some kind of administration room. Big giant safe still. Safely locked. So this is the main foyer to the factory. Huge high ceilings. There's been a fire down here, so you can see where the smoke has almost filled the room. It's like it's painted the room black and white. It's not caught here. <coughs> now these rooms here are flooded. They're really deep. That's scary. So, these stairs here remind me of uh, stairs that you see in uh, mental asylums, stop people from jumping off. So it makes no sense that they're locked. So you can see where people have gone to the, uh, the lengths to actually dig to get the cable out. It shows how valuable the cable must be. Well that's about it from me here in Birmingham. Hope you've enjoyed the video. I'll catch you on the next one, yeah? Ta-ra.